So Foot Birthday has just about arrived here, and we are going to have two weeks of non-stop promo fun with some really sick cards. Obviously on the screen right now, you guys are seeing the team leaked. Although I'm sure a majority of you guys will be watching this video after the promo has already released anyways. But yeah, the team looks super sick. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can make 500k plus easily throughout this promo. You guys can probably make 500k plus each week, honestly, maybe even in less time with just these three easy methods. Now, the first one is super simple, and it's a method that you guys want to do on Friday and Saturday here, closest to when you're watching. If not, you can do this during Team 2 when that drops during the lightning rounds as well. So right about 6 p.m. UK to 8 p.m. UK, we obviously get the lightning rounds where, you know, packs come in, pack supply comes in. This is the best time to buy cards, especially cards that are going to be needed all week through the various SBCs that EA is going to drop. So when the Friday lightning rounds hit, if they're not already out when you're watching this video, or the Saturday ones hit, go ahead and look into fodder. Fodder is super inflated at the moment. It's really high, and we're going to be likely getting party bags throughout the entire promo, as well as just player SBCs every day. Like, fodder is going to be super required throughout this entire promo, which makes it the perfect opportunity to buy these cards. Now, these higher rated cards, they've started to come down quite a bit. I said I like Sergio Ramos between 28 and 32k, and I think if you guys can buy even lower during lightning rounds through Friday and Saturday, you guys can make some serious coins on these cards when they're needed for the party bags. Not to mention, uh, you guys can also look for the drop of 84s, 85s, and even some of the 83s if they get to discard price. Fodder is going to be heading into that buy zone period, and lightning rounds is the perfect time to pick them up, because I can guarantee you that in a week of this video, coming out we'll have seen a party bag or we'll be getting rumors of the party bag for team two so definitely keep an eye on fodder heading into this but if you guys have like a lot of coins fodder can make you some serious coins in profit i can guarantee you that these cards are absolutely going to fly when the big sbc's start pumping in this promo especially because we've seen the players and what they look like they're super good now the next way you guys can make coins is, is a much lower budget way, but it's something you can do in between while you wait for fodder to fly, and that's going to be just mass bidding on cards. Now I like mass bidding on literally any of the fodder cards, especially like the 82s, the 83s, the 84s. Really you want to find any cards that are a little bit inflated from the rest. So you know most 83s, they currently sit at like 1.3k. Not Joel Matip, this card sits at about 2.5k. Now, of course, you can do sniping filters with these, but guys, bidding is super OP, especially during down times of the market. And you know, when we're not at that peak time, bidding is so OP. Like I said, Matip sells for 2.5k. So if you just set a bunch of bids on these cards, you know, at a reasonable price, maybe 1k is a little bit too low for me on these Matips, but say I bid, you know, 2k and I go ahead and win 15 of them or 20 of them or even 10 of them, that's a, you know, 500 coins per profit per card that's you know 10k for literally like uh, 30 seconds of work where i'm just you know putting bids on the cards and then just waiting so definitely look to hop into some of the bids mass bidding is extremely effective if you do it correctly now for foot birthday i only want you guys to stick to these two methods really stick to fodder because we are going to be getting prime icon moments on saturday and that is just going to make metas go crazy. You're probably going to see a lot of drops on a lot of big cards. So for that case, I'm only going to leave you with these two investments heading into foot birthday. If you guys enjoy this video, make sure you guys drop a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. See you next time. Peace.